What is up people? Today we're gonna learn a new trick. I'm so stoked to be skating today. It's been a good weekend, but I took some time to rest and we're back at it with another video. Today I'm gonna learn how to do late front shoves. We're gonna get this today. So I'm gonna get warmed up. Today we're doing POV. So those of you that like that, we're back at it. Do some POV, get some warm ups in, start trying this trick. Let's get it. All right, shout out to everybody that's new on the channel. It's been a crazy couple of weeks. Whoa. Yeah, the last two weeks have been fire, huh? Whoa. I had a video that I posted about Death Wish's new video. It was doing really well, but got copyrighted by Thrasher. I guess I didn't understand the rules of copyright, like, what I can use, what I can't use. Anyways, I just reacted to the video. Ended up getting taken down. It's my own fault, but a lot of people might be new from that video. So welcome. All right, so step one of the warm up is done. Just kind of riding around, getting the legs all loosey goosey. Now we're gonna do some kick flips. And I want to kick flip until my kick flips start to feel like I'm in control rather than just barely landing them. I want to feel like I'm stomping them, you know what I mean? Oh, rocket. I've changed my kickflip position and that's kind of messing with my kickflips are a lot more inconsistent now. That's a good one. Let's see if I can get one more of those. Not quite. One more. Whoa. See how far back I put my foot? I just keep messing with my foot position. All right. Do a quick fakey flip. <laughs> Landed straight on the ground. It's a little cold today. Warm up is a little bit slow. <laughs> you see how bad that was? Front foot catch. Okay, right here, this is gonna be a good fakey flip. The best I've gotten today, we'll keep it. Okay, let's do little nollie back 180. Whoa. Fakey front 180. Let's do half calves the other way. Nollie front side. Oh. Try that again. Here we go. Nollie front side. This is all this is my worst half calf by far. Whoa. Hanging on. And then regular half calves. I think this one is my best sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a regular shove it. All right. And now, for a new front shove. Let's see if I can make this one work today. <laughs> oh, you can see me land primo. I put, set my foot position up like right here. I feel like that's pretty normal. But I always under rotate a little bit. <laughs> I guess that's gonna be good enough for today. All right, first heel flip of the day. <laughs> Not too bad. Kind of rock it. See if we can level it out. <laughs> Would have been good, but I lost my balance. Right here. Rocket again and under rotate. Let's get it right here. <laughs> Can't get it. Try again. So I've been doing this exercise to help with my knees. Basically, you just stand on something and you act like you're gonna step down and then you step back. So you just come down, touch your heel, come back, and it just strengthens like your knee muscles right here, which get super worked out when you're skating and uh, if you have knee pain if you're like old like me this is the best thing that I've found to actually protect your knees 
And then watch. That's that's all you have to do to heel flip. You just just like that. I'm telling you. Back 180. Switch front 180. You think we got it? Been working on it a little bit. Hey, not bad. Another heel flip. <laughs> Garbage, but hey, still landed it. It's such a nice day right now. It's cold, but it's pretty, man. Like, kind of like twilighty and happy to be out here. My legs got cooked over the weekend. I've been jump roping every day and skating most days, and so my legs needed a break, but it's nice to be out here skating again. Okay, so I think we're gonna go ahead and get started with the trick challenge. Late front shove it. If you watch Brian Arnett, he is so good at these tricks, all the late tricks. He's got them down, but I've watched him do these tricks. I've watched him do late shove it's a ton, and I thought to myself, like, I could probably do that. And I found my ollies have been getting a lot better and a lot more tweaked. So I think that kind of works right into like ollieing up and then throwing that front shove it at the end. So we'll see how it goes, but uh, let's get into it. All right, just need to put my back foot on it. I need to keep it underneath me, but that's the problem right there. I would have been landing it this whole time had my shoe been tied. No doubt in my mind. My foot keeps on sticking on the front, so I think I need to just, if I practice like some Ollie Norse, to practice like getting my foot off of it. All right, we got a Brian Arnett late shove trick tip, so. So from what he's saying, it sounds like instead of popping straight, I need to pop a little bit like that. Like that. And then just flat feet and just scissor kick. So that was kind of it. Oh man, it starts to go and my foot gets in the way. Crooked Ollie. And then just keep it going with a little whoop. I wonder if I need to like point my toe a little bit. Yeah, I think so. I love that when I get close. My next try is always just complete garbage. Take some deep breaths. And let's do it. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I, oh my gosh, what in the world, what just happened? I changed my foot position, like the smallest amount, and it just hooked the board perfectly, and I landed on it. What the heck, let's see if I can do another. So I was just thinking about how my foot was like missing the hook. So I pointed it just like a little bit like that so that when it would come forward, I could like really hook the board. <laughs> That's it. Your boy is a failure. I just got that one crappy one. And then a crappy back three straight into a crappy front three. Oh, front 540. I'm gonna come back for these. Subscribe for part two.